I attended Florence Academy of Russian Art September of 2011 until June, September of 2015, that's when I graduated. Um, I am now attending Rhode Island School of Design and studying graphic design there. The Florence Academy of Russian Art gave me more than anything to develop my skills further now. It gave me confidence. And when making art, confidence is so important in how you attack a blank page. And it, there's a huge connection between the classical art and the modern world today. Uh, for a career, I see myself doing graphic design. Uh, the principles are very the same in terms of how we construct a composition. And I find that I'm very competent in my ability to approach a composition, whether it's in graphic design or in a classical study. Then my dream would be to, to be making art that's relevant and necessary for the time that I'm living in. Being three years in Florence is bliss. It's magical. And so, as a word of advice to future students, I would say to take advantage of the city as much as possible and to take advantage of their studios and professors as much as possible because now having left the school, I want to come back all the time and just be sketching and soaking in the inspiration of live models. So, if I were to tell future students three things to do and three things not to do, I would tell them to sketch every day. And when I was studying, we would sketch, we would make at least three sketches every day. And this is what made me progress the fastest. So absolutely, there's your one, two, three. Do three sketches a day. Do spontaneous paintings take advantage of the city, go to museums and make museum studies. Um, go to the museums that you have to pay for without your student card, it's worth all of the money and to travel around Italy and to see things. Um, also talk to your professors and get more knowledge from them besides artistic knowledge because they have a lot more to offer besides just to teach you where light and shadow goes. Three don'ts would be to not, well there's really not much you shouldn't do, <laughs> besides, you know, you should experiment as much as possible, don't be afraid, it's okay if your professor gets mad at you for trying something new, and um, it's okay to, to make a mistake on the paper, the professor's always there to hold your hand through it, <laughs> so just be really fearless in making the art and be as confident as possible because that's what gives the best result. Mm -hmm.